The Animorph is a critically acclaimed trilogy of novels set in post-World War II Russia with illustrations by J.K. Growling. Uh, later this year, it will be adapted into a motion picture with uh, Kristen Stewart as a starfish girl. The central theme of these literary masterpieces is that children can turn into animals. Like this girl turns into a uh, leaf in this novel. Uh, so celebrity appearances. Uh, product placement. Uh, this kid turns into a blue centurion, and then later on, that one turns into a raccoon. So he's really going for a loop on that one. Uh, this kid's having the time of his life. Uh, I don't know what animal that is. I gotta be honest with you. There's Wolverine. Um, the bird turns into a golden retriever. It's all based on a true story. There's also a game for the Game Boy dual screen by the creators of Assassin's Creed. You have to fight off aliens. It's very reminiscent of a classic Game Boy game. Uh, I can't put my finger on it. Uh, it was very, it was a very popular game for the Game Boy Color, I remember. It was a very popular series. Uh, it's kind of like an RPG, but you don't level up. There's no stats or thinking. The game drew controversy from uh, evolutionists because the people actually turn into animals here. So it kind of disproves their, their dumb theory. If you transform and uh, if you can't, you can't let other people see you transform because then they'll know their secret identity, but it, the game lets you do it anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and <laughs> I'm gonna go. Oh. Animal Crossing was the first game to disallow you to enter any building in the whole game. You just can't go in there. No dogs allowed. Oh no, tax on. Tax off. I killed him. Only an upstanding young black woman can enter this nice building here. And oh, well, I'll have to animorph into the rich white man to get up these stairs. Holy shit, the gorilla is the fastest guy at Holy crap. <laughs> There's also a turn-based RPG for the PS1 of Animorphs. 